Okay, I think he's drifted off. Gone. Got sick of us. Oh, I think sometimes the energy wanes, you know, like spirit can sort of manipulate for so long. You know, for so long. And then it's it's kinda of like they get tired and they, their energy wanes. So it could I still feel him here. Yeah. And I feel him with a hat. And I feel him, mm. you know, he was doing a lot of digging around here, private diggings. Here we go. Private diggings. Um I feel you get the chest thing too, yeah, because yeah, I get the heavier breathing. Did you have breathing problems? Can you light up the try and light up the meter if you had breathing problems or chest problems? Just before you passed away, were you coughing a lot? Because I'm I'm feeling you coughing a lot. Yeah, I'm wanting to cough. Yeah. Mm, me too. I'm feeling very <laughs> tight in the chest and yeah. tickle in the back of the throat. Coughing a lot. Was this yeah. happening to you just before you passed away? And there's a question for you. Do you realise that you've passed away? Is it, are you confused? Okay. Just wait for you to settle. Do you understand that you have passed away? That you're no longer in a human body? Do you understand that? Light it up if you do. Are you confused? Do you think that you're still alive? Do you wonder why it is that you can see us, we can't see you, and we have to use these different devices to communicate with you? Do you wonder that? Can you light it up? If that's a yes? Do you understand that we are using these di devices to communicate with you? Yeah, okay, good. Yep, cool. So you've realized, you've realized that you've passed away and you're still here. Can I ask you to really, really light it up if you like staying here? Light it up as high as you can. Yeah, we're hitting the red. So you love the area. Do you understand that you've got family that have crossed over to another place, a better place, and they're waiting for you, that you've got family waiting for you? Do you understand that? <laughs> Light it up if you do. Okay, light it up if you don't. We're just trying to figure out why you stay here. Is it? Do you stay in this area because you like it? Can you light it up if you like the area? Do you stay here because you've still got business here? <coughs> Do you stay here because you're not sure where to go or what to do next? If I go through some years, can you light it up when I get to the decade that's the closest when you were living here? I'm going to start at the 1860s. Got a bit of a light up there. Yeah. <clears throat> How about 1870s? Were you here in the 18? What about the 1880s? You want me to go down again? There's a little flash. Yeah. I get. I, I yeah. Yeah. You want me to go down? Okay. <coughs> so I'm going to start. I'm going to start at 1850s. Were you here in the 1850s? You were here in the 1860s. So I'm going to go through each year now. Were you here in 1860? 
1864 1865 1866 1867 1868 1869 couple of little flashes but you gave me a flash for 1861 three three okay so in 1861 did you come out here twice or more than once. Did you come out here more than once? Did you come out in 1861? Were you surveying the land for gold diggers? Were you making the tracks? Were you working for any of the gold diggers at all in any capacity? Were you just out here digging for gold on your own? Did you have your family with you? Yes. Yep, okay, you had family out here. And you lived way out here with your family. It's quite an achievement, it would have been pretty hard. What did, did you live on kangaroos for meat? Animals, local animals for meat. Did you grow your own vegetables? Did you get supplies from an, from nearest town? Did you create your own food and create your own supplies? Are you still with us? Can you light it up if you're still with us? I know your energy's got, starting to get a little bit weak now. I'm going to quickly go through the alphabet. <coughs> and can you light it up when I get to the letter of your first, the first letter of your name? All right. I'll just wait till you settle down. Okay, light it up if I get to the right letter, the first letter of your name. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, H. 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 I'm gonna ask you for the second letter of your first name. I'll wait for you to settle down. Same thing, light it up when we hit it. A. E. I. O. U. Hubert? Hang on. Wait for you to settle down a little bit. Okay, was it an O? Was it a U? H O H U Okay, how about a H-U-B? How about a... Losing the energy. Yeah. I feel, I, look, I feel, I'm feeling sort of like very... <laughs> really light. Yeah, mm. real light-headed feeling, the, losing the energy. Yeah. All right. I'm going to cut this off here. Um, 
mainly because I'm feeling that you're losing the energy and I'm me communicating with you. It's, it's making me feel rather drained too. It's okay. So we'd like to just thank you for coming and speaking to us. And we will come back again. Mm. You're on? Yeah. <laughs> I thought it was just me because I was looking at the camera. Yeah. Like, yeah. 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 You're right. Be careful of that the stump there down. too. We're just going to go down and put the car down there. Yeah. yeah. We might head that way. Yeah. There's a couple of cars. Yeah. 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 Y